While Chief Brian James made it clear chokeholds have never been part of police training, he announced they should never be used. Just one of the changes approved and now part of GPD policy. It's some things you're going to need to know about campaigning. After a week of protests organized by community leaders, Greensboro Police Chief Brian James says changes in the police department are on the way. Let me be clear. Those methods were never authorized, but this morning we put in policy specifically addressing chokeholds to ensure that that language is clear. Chief James putting in place policies restricting the use of chokeholds and requiring officers to intervene if they see excessive force. Community members like Casey Thomas, who helped organize recent protests in downtown Greensboro, say more needs to be done. We want laws that are passed that are not just internal policy changes, but that have an entire overhaul of the use of force policy that can keep people safer and that are permanent changes. I do think that one more more people who are doing grassroots work in the community need to be at the table. Chief James will also require a follow up psychological assessment for all officers every five years. These changes are now in effect. The chief agrees with the community. It's not over yet. It definitely needs to be more communal. It needs to have the community involved. It needs to have someone from the outside. I just want to see more policy change. I want to see more black people, more black women in positions of power. This is just a start. This work is still not done. Earlier this year, GPD held several community meetings as Chief James started his new position as Greensboro's top cop. The coronavirus brought those meetings to a halt, but James says he still wants the community's help moving forward.